Hey everyone, this is Tane playing Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Last time, we were about to open up the big giant door of time. Um, so yeah, let's do that. There are three hollows. So... Um... Let me remember this song really quick. Um, we're missing some songs here. Noticed. Okay. So. Wait, no. Ah! The three spiritual stones, also magical. And are they gonna float down into the three little slotty slots? Well, cause I like it. Ho ho ho! Ho ho ho! Try force, try forcing it up, and then opens the door of time. The Temple of Time by playing the Song of Time. Now we're going into the Room of Time. Actually, I don't think this is called the Room of Time. This is. Tate, hey, isn't that? Yes, it is, Navi. Yes, it is. The Master Sword. One of the most amazing weapons in all of video game history. It's that legendary blade! The Master Sword! Again, another really famous thing of the Zelda series. I think every Zelda game has it. Not, maybe not like the first one. We've got a nice big room here. Nice altar for it. And should we grab it? Should we? Let's do it. Oh man, I think we just activated ourselves a cutscene. <laughs> yes, go let work. As I thought, you held the keys to the door of time. You have led me to the gates of the sacred realm. Yes, I owe it only you, kid. <laughs> Tame. Wake up. Tame, the chosen one. Nice, lovely water animation. But where are we? This is not the Temple of Time. <gasps> and who's that? I am Raru, one of the ancient sages. Ages ago, we ancient sages built the Temple of Time to protect the entrance to the Sacred Realm. This is the Chamber of Sages, inside the Temple of Light. The Temple of Light, situated in the very center of the Sacred Realm, is the last stronghold against Ganondorf's evil forces. The Master Sword, the evil destroying sword that you pulled out of the pedestal of time, was the final key to the Sacred Realm. Tain, don't be alarmed, look at yourself. <gasps> We're all grown up! Oh wow! Puberty in five seconds. 
It's pretty impressive. Look, Kane, you're big now! You've grown up! The Master Sword is a sacred blade which evil ones may never touch. Only one worthy of the title Hero of Time can pull it from the pedestal of time. However, you were too young to be the Hero of Time. Therefore, your spirit was sealed here for seven years. And now that you are old enough, the time has come for you to awaken as the Hero of Time. Well, do you understand your destiny? Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no, yes, yes, yes. But remember, though you opened the door of time in the name of peace, Ganondorf, the Gyrdo King of Thieves, used it to enter this forbidden sacred realm. He obtained the Triforce from the Temple of Light, and with its power he became the King of Evil. His evil power radiated from the temples of Hyrule, and in seven short years it transformed Hyrule into a world of monsters. My power now has only little influence even in this sacred realm, namely this chamber of sages. But there is still hope. The power of the sages remains. When the power of all the sages is awakened, sage seals will contain all the evil power in the void of the realm. I, Rauru, am one of the sages, and your power to fight together with the sages makes it you the hero of time. The hero of time chosen by the master sword. Keep my spirit with you and find the power of the other sages and add their might to your own. Yay! So now we get this coin thing symbolizing the power of the first sage. You received the Light Medallion. Raru, the Sage, adds his power to yours. And this this whole... Find the other Sages and save Hyrule. The whole Medallion thing and the Sages giving you their power is one thing I don't like. Because as far as I know, like from playing the game, there's... The, the power that they give you is like purely for the storyline. Like, you're not any stronger, you don't get any new abilities. You know, you don't... Nothing changes about the gameplay, but you have, you know, these new supposed powers of the sages. Tane, we're back in the Temple of Time! But has seven years really passed? It looks like you won't be able to use some of the weapons you found as a kid anymore! Let's get out of here! I've been waiting for you, Hero of Time. When evil rules all, an awakening voice from the sacred realm will call those destined to be sages who dwell in the five temples. One in a deep forest, one on a high mountain, one under a vast lake, one within the house of the dead, one inside a goddess of the sand, Together with the Hero of Time, the Awakened Ones will bind the evil and return the light of peace to the world. This is the legend of the temples passed down by my people, the Sheikah. I am Sheik, survivor of the Sheikah. As I see you standing there holding the mystical Master Sword, you really do look like the legendary Hero of Time. If you believe the legend, you have no choice. You must look for the five temples and awaken the five centuries. One sage is waiting for the time of the awakening in the forest temple. The sage girl, I am sure you know. Because of the evil power in the temple, she cannot hear the awakening call from the sacred realm. Unfortunately, Equipped as you currently are, you cannot even enter the temple. But if you believe what I'm saying, you should head to carry your village. Do you understand, Tane? 
Oh, if you couldn't tell by my voice, this is a girl. J just letting you know. To save the forest, girl, you need another skill. I do get care for your village. She's still there. Okay, so she's gone. Nope, she's still there. That character is a thing about disappearing. She does it a lot. It's kind of a deal. So this is what I would say is the beginning of the real game. Um, it's what I, you know, personally would call it. Um, and this is also one of the things that I don't like. Is in the real game, everything is destroyed, and you have these things. I, I want to... wait. No, oh, I don't think I can target them here. But those zombie things scare the poop out of me. Um... Yeah, they... I'll, I'll explain them later once I get to fight them. But according to Sheik, of the she does. We need to go to Kakario Village. Um, so what I think I'm gonna do is, once I get up here, I'm gonna end at least it for now, because I have somewhere I need to be. I don't know if I'll do like a part B deal later, but if not, you know, I'll see you guys tomorrow or whatever. Anyways, this has been Tane, playing Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. See you guys next time.